Colt McCoy, the hottest quarterback in the country. McCoy to the end zone. Touchdown. McCoy's going to go for the end zone. Touchdown, Texas. Colt McCoy made it look easy tonight. McCoy looking up top, wide open. What a fake. What a perfect throw. We continue our look this week at the stellar crop of quarterbacks competing for this year's Heisman Trophy. And Colt McCoy from Texas, a favorite of many. He won't be playing for the national title this year, but he will be back with the Longhorns again next season to take another shot. McCoy leading the nation in completion percentage after passing for almost 3,500 yards and 32 touchdowns. Also a threat on the ground, he was the Longhorns' leading rusher, rushing for 10 touchdowns and was named Big 12 Offensive Player of the Year. For more on the real McCoy. Here's Jesse Palmer. Colt McCoy may have been the most versatile quarterback in all of college football this year, throwing for 32 touchdown passes and leading his team in rushing with 576 yards and 10 scores. What steps out most to me about Colt McCoy this year was his accuracy. He completed over 77% of his passes, easily on pace to smash Dante Culpepper's record set back in 1998. When you look at the body of work for Colt McCoy this year, so impressive. He completed 80% of his passes against then number one Oklahoma, 91% of his passes against Missouri. Missouri. He completed 18 straight balls against Oklahoma State. I think Colt McCoy's numbers statistically match up very favorably to Sam Bradford and Tim Tebow. But unlike Bradford and Tebow, Colt McCoy is not playing in this year's national championship game. And because of that, I do not think McCoy will win this year's Heisman. Well, we will find out Saturday night at 8 o'clock Eastern. The Heisman Trophy will be awarded here on ESPN. And Thursday night, Chris Fowler, Lee Corso, and Kirk Herb Street host the Home Depot ESPNU College Football Awards coverage beginning at 7.30 Eastern. Josh?